Heya, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Today we're playing some more Cyberpunk and we are going to make Judy my girlfriend. Yes, I'm, why am I so excited for that? What happened with Evelyn was so sad. I actually felt really bad for Judy as well. So I kind of want to see how that's going to pan out. And with that said, let's go on ahead and play some more Cyberpunk. Let's just run around and see if she's going to message us. Oh, wow! Parkour! Parkour! Oh. Oh no, now she's gonna think we're clingy. Let's fast forward. <sighs> what would... If Judy could look outside her apartment and she just sees us running around. I don't think she'll ever text us anymore. <laughs> Shawty little baby. What in the fuck? Fuck! Just when she texted us! Did she just text us? Oh, shit! Well, at least this time around she won't think we're clingy because... Yes. Because <laughs> it's like the phone call never happened. Man. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh shit, parkour! Parkour! <laughs> Oh, got it. Oh my god. Oh, let's try this. Oh my god! I thought she would stop! Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh! <laughs> I didn't think it'd still keep going. That's pretty cool. What would happen if. We pointed our gun at him. This is fun. I didn't know we could do this. But how do we get off? Shit. Oy, pokay ng inagago. What the fudge? That this is pretty fun. Oh shit. How about that? Gary. Uh, oh, it's Carrie. Johnny? V. Disappointed. It's a beautiful day, huh? Cool. <laughs> oh, shucks. Ooh, was it a headshot? Oh, I well, would have been better if it was a headshot though. Oh, his arm isn't working. Look at that. That's so cool. It's like if you really did get shot in the arm. Oh, <laughs> nice. All this for a girl. All this effort for a girl. I shouldn't really complain. This isn't even the bare minimum. It's below the bare minimum. <laughs> Aww, they're going on a date. What? My oh my, look at her. So pretty. Hanako. Hi, Nako. Oh my god, she's. Hey. Oh. She's How you going? feeling? Yeah. Shitty. But something came to me. Yeah. Uh, what came to you? So what did you come up with? The Mox Dive, Lizzie's Bar, used to be a joy house. Tiger Claws killed one girl too many, so people took matters into their own hands. Belongs to us now. Yeah, I know about that story. Clouds could stand to get the same makeover. Takeover at Lizzie's Bar wasn't exactly smooth. Sure you've got- you've thought this through? Sure you've thought this through, Judy? Carefully? Haven't thought it through at all. All I know is the mocks didn't turn things around by sitting on their tanned and toned asses doing nothing. I'm familiar with the story. 
Things did not go that smoothly. I didn't say they did. Didn't say they would. But Evie thought Clouds would be safe. You saw how far that got her. How she ended. V. I can't stand by and let things go on like this. Okay. Got the mocks to agree to take over Clouds. Let's do no, it! I'm trying to get you. Know someone at Clouds will take our side. Will you help? Yeah, I'll help. Fine. Got me on board. Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> what's the plan? <laughs> I feel First like down, I'm so desperate to, to get her Michael approval. Mind. If she's not with us, might as well throw our hands up in the air. This Michael, who is she exactly? Michael Maeda. Who is she exactly? Girl who unofficially runs clouds. Good at it too. What's she do officially? She's a doll, so she's a nobody. Sure Maiko's gonna wanna join forces? If I was sure, I'd be on the hollow to her and we wouldn't be having this conversation. Let me rephrase. Any chance she'll slap us around and then shove us out her mega tower window? Of course, sure. Guess I can work with that? When you want to When are we doing this? Early morning. Clouds will be closed. Hardly a soul lurking at that time. Nice. How early? Before eight. I'll be by the entrance. Oh, scratch that. The balcony above clouds. We'll sneak in. Before no one eight. needs to know we're there. On the balcony. Got it. Early morning before eight. Alright, here we go. X Factor. Let's do it. I was so I'm so happy she called us back finally. Because that means she didn't leave us on red. <laughs> Uh, oh, do I want it? Okay, journal, X Factor, let's do it. Oops. I'm craving for some egg fried rice again. Let's fast travel to that place. There's a fast travel thing here. A while ago, I don't know if you noticed, I kept walking while Judy was talking to me because I was kind of imagining what if. I really did live in, in Night City, and then, you know, that's this is how we talk. Walking carefully on the street, well, somewhat carefully. At least I have a gun. So if someone tries to jump me, I could just... Shoot them back. <laughs> like, it's that easy! There we go, over here. Early morning. Four eight. So let's skip the time to I guess twelve hours. Ah, shit. Clouds Terrace. There we go. Stop. The fuck? <laughs> I mean, it's not like I know it's a natural thing, but I get really uh, when I hear people moan. It's weird. Masala Studios. That sounds like a Tagalog word. Or no, Indian. <gasps> I'm craving for curry as well. I think I'm hungry. <laughs> I think I'm just hungry. I was ready to have like googly eyes if I see her. <sighs> okay. I'll 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 sing the background. Oh what the heck? <laughs> Song. If I see her. Oh what the heck? She's not here. I thought she'd be here. We can just wait. Let's just wait then. 
Tapi Hey V. Thanks for showing. She's so hot. Talking she should stop smoking like a though. game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. Bruh, she really is freaking hot. Look at that. I dig. I dig it. I should Okay, screenshot. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to cosplay her. Uh-huh. You seem a bundle of nerves. I've a mind to kill the bastards with my bare hands. So yeah. You could say I'm a teensy bit nervous. Some deeds about her could be useful when I talk to her, don't you think? No. Leave the talking to me. Rest your hustle. How you aim to bring her? How do you aim to get her over to our side? By telling the truth about Evelyn, what happened, and what. Wow, I like her. Think that'll cut it. No, have to improvise from there. So, in brief, I'm just here as your hustle, right? Never said that. I just know the woman better. I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> Smiling. I like her eyeliner. Fudge. It's so beautiful. Hold on. I'll open it. Does she have a tramp stamp? Oh, she does. It's a seahorse. Now to get around their systems, you've used their entrance before. Let's just say this. Walk like that. No way you cracked it open on your first try. Know how to get around their systems? Appears so. I was hoping they hadn't run any updates since I left. Looks like I was right. Easy as paella. Paella! Oh. Follow me. I'm not gonna comment about food. I talk too much about food, so I'm not. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Oh. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yep, bet I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. Consorting with a common thug. Oh, you call yes, me? Yes, I mean you. What'd you call me? Sounds like I left a mark on this place. Good. If by mark you mean buckets of blood, then yeah, congrats. <laughs> don't mind me if you blend into the furniture. Oh, don't mind me. Just here to blend into the decor. That's no reason. Why come at all? To make sure Judy gets what she came for. Jude would have had a better chance without you. That's all you're good at, blowing hot air. Judy has a proposal. About clouds. Wanna come back? Done. I've always valued your skills, you know that. Just don't get why you had to drag this loose end in here. Stop treating dolls like meat and I'll consider it. But first things first. Clouds needs to be taken from the tiger claws. Okay, look. It's clear what happened to Ev was traumatic. Huh? I was convinced you didn't know. That girl was asking for an unhappy ending. I was just surprised it took so long. We gotta do something! Or oh. everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious, then sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Yeesh. I hate Okay, it. since you seem more reasonable, care to explain what this is about? It's a waste of time. A cloud's employed to take advantage of Evelyn. Judy's idea? Think about it. Could work. Well, well, Jude. See, you found a true and loyal fan. You aware what Woodman did to Evelyn when she was desperate for help? You sit by, let that happen? Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? Oh. About as much as he you basically moonwalks. Problems mean to me: greed, 
negligible. This shouldn't be work. Shouldn't be working here then. Does it make you wonder why you even work here? Yeah. She's in the comp. Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. What an ass. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. And so you don't think I'm brushing you off completely? Forrest will be on the maintenance level in a couple minutes. Alone. You picked the wrong side, Michael. I'll be the judge of that. I'm not your enemy here. And I didn't ask for your opinion. Ah, oh, let's kill her. Ooh. That went smoothly. She totally blew us off. Might need time to think. Know what I think? She's scared stiff. She'd have lots to lose if things went sour. Everything, in fact. So she'll just let things go on as usual? You two have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. So was I. <laughs> Can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. Line between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, used to have a big crush on her. Took me a long time to realize who she really was. Oh! But still, honest or crooked, we need her. Just think, oh, yeah, could have died this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah. You, a deck chair, and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella. Somehow, I don't see it. No. Me in the deck chair is me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Wait a sec. What about Woodman? We killed a motherfucker. What do you want to do? Oh. What do you want to do? I'm gonna kill him. I want somebody to unload lead into his face till there is no face. Perfect. <laughs> I knew I liked you. Fine. I knew there was a reason why I like you. I want you to do it. Shh. Okay. You sure he's gonna be there? You met Michael. If that prick still works here. It's cause he follows her orders pretty damn precisely. Don't have an ounce of sympathy for that motherfucker. Yeah! So, we go in there? Damn straight. Let's end him. We'll take the elevator. Quickest way. Maintenance level. You know what's worse than a corpo? A wannabe corpo bitch. You mean Michael? Piece of work that one, but I'll give her credit. She doesn't. He doesn't She's look like Keanu. Chances of pulling this off. At all with this, he needs to wear his shades. Maintenance. Ride the elevator to the maintenance. Wow. Why did? You know what? She could have pressed the button herself, but she asked us to do it. 
I don't mind. I'm gonna protect my baby. She's not yet my baby. I'm gonna wait for her to give me permission to make her my baby. <laughs> what? I'm simping over Judy so hard. Where's Maiko? Why'd you fucking call me here? Evelyn's dead. Come here just to tell me that. It's fucking kind of you to remember. Here. Go light a candle. When Evelyn needed help, you reaped her. Could have also broken her neck. Hung up her head like a chandelier till it started to rot. <laughs> Instead, I took her to a ripper. Was due a little something in return. She should be grateful. And so should you. Hmm. Here's my token of Let's, uh, let's get out of here. Oh Dude the fuck I just let's do this too. Yes, that's what we do to rapists. I did not think I had my sniper with me, but okay. Oh, you okay? Be satisfied. You should have shot him in the nuts as well. Punch the ground floor. Need to get out of this place. Okay, because you seem like you're traumatized. Ground floor. Almost felt like the world would be a better place once you died. And the feeling, it was so fucking strong. Mm, revenge is really important. The world did change, though. All the people he could have hurt, they're all safe now. Think of that. They'll never even know they were in danger. Okay. There's nothing I can do if you don't help me. Guess that's that. You're screwing with my head. There's that time. Yelling comes in. I love her. Gotta get back to Michael with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough. Michael only works with specifics. For a minute there, thought you were about to call it quits. V, I go for days tuning virtues in a basement. Know what the chances are of somebody blowing my head off down there? Minuscule. Same as Michael's empathy. Unlike you, I don't put myself out there. But this ain't over. Not yet. You know, I'm also partial to specifics. Uh-huh. So that's what matters. How many you'll drop. How much ammo you'll use. How many eddies it'll get you. Art and dreams of freedom can't be everyone's food. Sometimes. You gotta deal with the dirt. So. What now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. Let's do it. I'll call you when I've got something. Oh, all right. See you later, V. And thanks. <gasps> I thought she was gonna kiss me on the cheek. Man, where is she going? I want to see how she's going to exactly leave. Oh, is this her car? Is that her car? Oh, that is her car. Bye, baby. You don't know it yet, but... Yeah. <laughs> I guess we should just wait, then.
skip time 24 hours. Overtake. Yeah. Wait, did I? Oh, there we go. Hey V, wanted to thank you again, you know, for helping me clouds. Don't want to think about what L3. Don't want to think about what could have happened if you hadn't been there. Anyway, I think I got something in my own. Can't go into detail, but I'll holler at you in a couple of days. Oh, and have a... Ah, she told us to have a fabulous day! And she sent the winking emoji. Well, not emoji, but she went the winking smiley. Wait for Judy's call. Okay. I guess we should just wait for her call. How? Maybe we should skip time again another 24 hours. <gasps> there we go. Judy. So? Got a plan? Damn right I do. Yeah. I'm over to mine tonight. Gonna lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with us. Yeah. Michael will be here too. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? Oh, all right. Oh, uh, artichoke and avocado. I and say that. Artichokes and avocado flavor, and zucchini for good measure. Ooh, fancy. So I'll see you come evening. I'll be there. You gonna tell me this big secret of yours? Figured out how to tweak behavioral chips, turn dolls into fighters. Sounds like my kind of plan. We'll go over the specifics tonight. You're coming, right? Of course I'll be there. Boy. Park outside. Because for some magical reason, someone's gonna take it and I don't have to pay a fee. Okay, let's go in, let's go in. Hey V. Oh come on in. Pizza's getting cold. Ooh. It's a sleepover. We're in the kitchen. You made it. Good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's worked at clouds longer than any of us. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. <laughs> Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? Um, let's go. Feeling better? You look better. I'm on autopilot. I don't think. Just do. Sound method. Did you know Evelyn well? Oh, wait. Come here, cuz... You want payback for what happened to her? That's for sure. But I just want to have a normal job, too. No fears, no tears, you know? Oh. Oh! I'll She's never here. get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? Subtle as always. So what's this plan all about? I'd like we don't to hear like the her. answer to that too. A we modified like her. behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. You'll air it out Ooh. later. Ooh. Bitch. Fine. I'll sit by the window. She's rude. I don't know what Judy ever saw in her. a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on top. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Oh, 
this have any side effects? Being a solo is a lot more than executing a series of movements. How do you ever come up with this? What's how up did you? you ever come up with this? Learned how the behavioral chip works at Clouds. Always seemed like they must be pretty easy to modify. I'm surprised I didn't get the idea the moment we walked into Maiko's office. Count yourself lucky. What with all the cams and mics and clouds? Tiger Claws would sooner dig those chips out of the dolls with screwdrivers than let an idea like this run its course. Hmm, let's ask this have any tech side that's all pros and no cons. I don't buy it. Side effects, spill them. Combat mode auto initiates when a threat is present, and uh, there's no way to stop it. Can't find a workaround. And that's it. I don't know. Only way to determine that would be through months of testing on a range of subjects. We don't there's have an months. ethical side, too. You can murder someone and not remember a thing. Solo skills don't lie in just executing movements. There are split-second processes that happen. Logistics, decision-making, result of years of practice. Doubt your chip's capable of compensating for that. You're probably right, but I don't see another way. Alternatives intensive training, but we don't have time for that. Hmm, all right. Gotta see it to believe it. Finally, someone said it. Tom? that sequence from a kung fu training virtue. Oh, look at him with his short shorts. The fuck? Oh. Whoa. Not Gotta bad. Gotta admit, not bad. Yeah, for the market square in Kabuki. Uh, before we start talking serious biz, gonna need to see serious action. You just saw him. I saw a bar trick. I want to see a fight. Got an expert in causing bodily harm among us. I want to see how Tommy handles her. V? Oh, you met me? Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. Son of a bitch. Why me? <laughs> Fine. How do I do? It's on now! What the? Oh, <laughs> nice. You there? Can you hear me? Wait, what the <laughs> heck? Look at me go. She's not looking at me! Oh, that, that, there she is. Woo! I'm all. Gotta do some three. cardio! Uh, I'm all. Nice work. I'll see, nice work, Judy. Nice work, Judy. I did yourself. If you were to Glitch. sell that. Be the richest Judy in the NUSA. Please. Plenty of killing machines in the world. I don't want to turn more people into them. After this, chips are getting micro nuked. Mm. V? Let's ask Johnny, got it. If you've got something to say, just say it. Who, me? This is my impressed face. Oh, really? I don't care about Michael. Okay. Probably settles it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down. Disarm. Escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead of you. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sato's the man you gotta get to. Uh... Where do we find this Hiromi? At his apartment, H8 Mega Tower, topmost floor. It's a penthouse, almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. Hmm, plan could just work better off trying to get at him on the street. Will Tom and Roxanne come? Tom and Roxanne gonna come with? No, whole points to strike both places at the same time. They'll take care of business at Clouds. 
Two-pronged assault. Loving it. Uh... <laughs> plan just might work. Kinda Michael, go with the plan. take it you're on board too? Wouldn't be wasting my time here if I wasn't. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. I'm with it all the way. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? Oh, you can count, count on me. Count me in, Judy. Already said I'd help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Stop calling them whores! Save the gratitude for later, please. <coughs> I'll have to meet with Hiromi and let you know. I need a couple days. I don't want to look at have this Have fun. Screen. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. I feel a migraine coming on. Oh! Oh, shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do will usually come to the price tag, I know. Oh, you she's so help, beautiful! It, but I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels uh, like it's only right. Let's say out of the question. Judy, for real? No, <laughs> don't want to hear it. Stop! Uh, 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 uh. Not a word. Oh! Oh! <sighs> Uh, uh, v, everything okay? Ah! V, v. <sighs> okay, okay, I'm better. Fine. What the hell, V? You like sick? Uh, let's say forget it. It's past. It's past. Forget about it. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Oh, yeah! Sure, thanks. Sounds great. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home. Yeah! Excited! Is it gonna happen now? Does she like us now? Does she like me now? Can I ask her to be my girlfriend already? <laughs> oh, Judy. Morning. Oh my goodness, she's calling a sleepyhead. Had to run, didn't want to wake you. Left you some breakfast. Eat up. She knows me. She knows me. Wow. Oh, she made me a ham and cheese sandwich with a cup of coffee. Well, at least we got it, so at least she knows that we got it. Man. Nancy. Hey V, you see the news? Some sort of messaging just to brag about my prize, but also to say that this piece couldn't have happened without you. Oh wait, this is not okay. I'll admit, mostly I wanted to brag. I'll say happy for you, Nance. Oh wait, where is she? Oh, she scared me. Oh, it's raining. Oh. oh, wow, my car, we just stayed here. That's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and buy a car. I'm bored. <laughs> Let's buy a car. I'm bored. <laughs> I guess we're just waiting for Judy to call us back at this point. And we've already like fast forwarded three days worth. So let's just wait, I guess. Oh! 
There we go! Judy! Knock, knock, what's up, house things? I'm good. Let's say you know how it is. Why something that matter? Had a great time in spite of this. Just without spilling any blood. That's what I mean. Anytime. Can't wait. Ah! Anyway, still waiting for Michael to spill the deets on our meat. Call you when I know more. Look at us! We sound so cool! We sound so cool just replying to her in like one sentences. No smiley. And she's like... She sent this one, the... The... I don't even know how to call this. And they were like, anytime. And then she said, can't wait. Ah! We got her! Yeah. And we will take care of her. Mm-hmm. Wait for Judy's call. Okay, we'll just wait for her call then. Oh, you know what? Maybe we could just skip time. Wow, she saved us seventy-five thousand dollars. Cause I was so close to buying the car. What the fudge was that? Something exploded. Weird. <sighs> I guess we're still waiting for her call. And our car is gonna arrive in three. Two, one. E oh yeah, this was where Johnny's body got buried. Or we thought got buried. Basically our intimate Ooh, there we go. Hey V. Michael called. Before sundown. Out front of the Mega Tower. Gonna be there? Of course I will. See you then. Nice. Let's do it. Meet with Judy and the dolls. Okay. Oh, the game is more stressful than life itself. Hey, V. Ooh. You ready? Hey, heal. Okay. Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. And Michael? Where's she? Meeting with Hiromi to avoid raising any suspicions. She'll make him stay put until we're in. All right. We going in? Let's do this. Nice. Funky monkey. <laughs> you two head in right after us. Wow, look at her outfit. About fucking time. He looks like a bit, he looks a bit like Rami Malik. Might be lurking. What the heck? Why? Why did she call me? She was literally right beside me. Got a jack into the panel on the other side. Can you take him out? Yeah, no problem. Defeat the tiger claws. I see, I see. 
<gasps> that was fun. Okay, let's do it. What the heck? Oh shit! Oh, shit. <gasps> oh fuck! Well, I was. I don't know why I was using that gun to begin with. <laughs> that was messy. I did not want to kill her like that, but I mean. Let's eat something. We never really eat something. We never really feed V. What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. Oh, first, think, you gotta I get into the penthouse. Can you get me in the penthouse? Okay, on my way. Elevators on the other side. Be safe. for implant certification will shutter its doors next Tuesday. The How's the sitch? We're inside of clouds. Who's taking which floor? I'll take the lower level. Tom will head upstairs. We're all set. any fucking dinner. Everything you cook tastes like sawdust anyway. Me too. Oh my god. Oh well. They punched the alarm. Not if I got anything to say about it. CEO tested himself in the Grand Canyon. <laughs> you think it was his idea? Fuck yes. Sales are dead. Who's there? 
there. <sighs> fucking wish. People like him never can. You dishonorable oh, bitch! Shoot him in the butt. Okay, now can't use it anymore. Oh, same here. Go to the surveillance cam in front of the security room. I was hoping you'd make less trouble getting here. Luckily, they're all jacked into virtues. It'd be game over otherwise. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This one's a real charmer, too. Could have called off the guards. Don't like her either. I don't like her either. Tries too hard. <laughs> Let's do this. He could have. Uh. Can we get this over with? Why are there three guys? What's she playing at? Yeah, why are there three guys? That's our target, Hiromi Sato. Uh, what are they watching? Demo reel of Cloud's next top doll. Specially selected by yours truly. A lucky girl's gonna replace Evelyn. Hope she proves smarter. Who are the other two? Target audience of today's presentation. Hiromi answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on I my face. I know the claws. To them, power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Michael! I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? All right, I'll do what I can. Jack him out. Well, she is no Barker. Wait, what's going on? Who is this? Ooh. Living proof that Hiromi Sado's time is up. This merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. She murdered Oswald Forrest. And now she's invaded Mr. Sato's private residence. What the fuck? As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sato's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck she doing? Clouds need new men. Hold on, Michael. Think you're getting carried away. I see not all has been agreed. Uh, hey, you got to take him down. That's why we're here. Hi. Bored of all this chatter. I'd rather we just cut to the quick. Oh, fuck you myself. Uh, that's the last time we do that. See, what the hell were you thinking? Have you any idea what's going to happen now? What might that be? They'll have their revenge. You've turned clouds into a ticking time bomb. Uh... Tried to pull a fast one on everybody, didn't ya? Jumped aboard the Liberation Train, pretending you wanted to help. But all you wanted was to take yeah, Hiromi's place. Yeah, okay, yeah, I thought so. Yeah, I was like loading with what was happening Just right now. Detail. I still can. And no one can stop me. Not their corpses, not yours. All right, V, get out of there. Exit's on the lower level of the apartment. <laughs> then find the elevator. I like the bounce back. Let's get that. Mm, I don't need the machete. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. What's this? Ooh! Yes, we'll get that. <laughs> Don't need that. Don't need that. <laughs> they all died so weird. Oh, we chopped off his leg. That's cool. 
Okay. All right, let's get out of here. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Get down to street level. Waiting by the food stalls. Nice. plan for it to happen. I know. Well, she did attack us! Give me a sec. Gotta gather my wits. Oh my god, is she I, gonna uh, get mad at me? She is her ex. I gotta process all this in peace. Alone. Be seeing you, V. <sighs> See ya, Judy. No! What the four? And she just disappeared. Okay, you guys. I'm gonna call it a day. I don't really know what. Oh no! What if we ruin our chances with her? Well, we'll find out in the in the next episode. But I feel like we're making some progress with her. Hopefully, it's not one of those situations where it's one step forward, two steps back. But we'll see. As always, if you guys like the video, do give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Baby. Hey Jude, what's up? Uh, you know, fame old. You? Mm. <laughs> Funny, I was just thinking about you. What do you so, mean, do Jess? Mean we always think about her. Are you always thinking about me? <laughs> you know, I could be cursing your name in my thoughts. Oh, hey. I'm just glad you remember me at all. Because I got a favor to ask. Ask away. It's never boring with you. Interesting people aren't easily bored. Not in your company. Okay, now that we've blown uh, each other, we are what's full up? out flirting. You're on a need to know basis. So, this particular mission don't require you to have no gun, just a wetsuit. Uh, All right then, count me in. But I gotta warn you, I look great in a wetsuit. Believe it when I see it. Sex. Damn Alpaca Coronado. <laughs> know it? Sure. What about it? Little uh, abandoned bungalow lakeside. Meet me there at sundown. GG. Uh, should I say it? Okay. Yeah. Um, is this a date? Guess you'll have to find out. We'll have to. See ya, V. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't like this type of flirting. It's my heart can't handle it. Like just tell me if you like me, please. But also me, you're too easy. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> uh... So... It's just fast travel. There's the... Oh, there. Oh, it's up. By the way, guys, I have been obsessed with TikTok. Like, I actually have my own TikTok. It's Carlos Scott Sarah. But I'm obsessed with this <laughs> one guy. I forgot his username already, but I just... Um, the theme of his TikToks would always be him running towards something. And what the fuck? Oh, wait, there is. <laughs> I thought there wasn't a fast travel there. Um, he would always be running towards something, and I don't know, it's just this cool motion. And that's something I've been trying to learn. I've been trying to learn how to make cool transitions on TikTok. But there may come a time when I'll just delete everything and then start fresh and then just 
take TikTok seriously then. <laughs> but yeah. Now I'm just really focused on. Oh, here it is. That's pretty far. Do I just run? Yeah. But yeah, the time will come when I will take TikTok seriously, but. Why well, I'm already taking it semi serious. It's fun. It's just really fun in that app. It's so dark. Wait for Judy. Oh, oh we're early. Punctual. Very punctual. Bitch, we waited until the early morning. <laughs> Excited much? <laughs> oh, shit. She's singing something. Oh god, I don't like I don't like this part of the V. Looking good? Okay. You mean considering the shit we've been through? Well, Aww. factor that in and you look fucking amazing. Ooh. So ready to tell me what we're doing here? Well, been tinkering with virtues a lot lately and figured out a way to scroll two actors' experiences at the same time. Thought we She's could so try it out. Smart. If you're down, of course. Hmm. Let's use this. Let's take advantage. How does one marry two oh, separate neural tracks? I leveled up so much. Well, at first <laughs> I tried to create a single profile out of two data streams. Didn't turn out so great. Must have gotten tangled up. Interference, white noise. Yeah, effect was kind of like a bad art house. Couple tries in, though. I managed to isolate specific sensations. So you load them onto separate neural tracks. No emo bogeys. Not bad. Mm. Sounds like we could do this anywhere. Why did we come all the way out here? What is this place? Cottage belonged to someone I knew. It sits empty now. I take the liberty to use it from time to time. Yeah, but and why that's here? that's where we're gonna scroll? No, we're gonna scroll underwater. Nope, no way. Bad idea. Tell her to find some other yes woman. Oh, Johnny. What do you say? You in? Mm, I'll say hell yeah, I'm in. Hell yeah, I'm in. Awesome. So, uh, let's go. Got the hardware here. Oh, Johnny probably doesn't like to swim. Dude, her ass looks so good. What the hell? What the heck? Right. Get that booty of yours suited up. I, oh God, I was literally just looking at her booty. <sighs> Let's get this scroller on you. The water looks so freaking good. Oh, the water's toxic? <laughs> really? You're in for something Nova, believe me. Water's toxic, that not a problem? The whole reason we're suiting up. All right, let's do this. Whew, freezing ass water, here I come. Dude, she's so freaking hot. Okay, we're all set. You go first. Don't descend too fast. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh. Why'd she call me? Where are we headed, exactly? About halfway to the deepest point. It'll be pitch black, but the currents are gentle. Ought to be safe. Want the precise coordinates? No, I bother. I'll just stay close to you. Okie dokes. Okie dokes? She says that? So hot. Virtues are more to you than just a way to churn out eddies, huh? 
Well, duh. Think it. Paintings, songs, they're meant to produce emotion responses. Generally how any kind of creativity works, sure. Right, so art's a casing, trigger for emotion. Well, BDs are emotion in near pure form. It is pitch black. Dude, this is so freaking cool. This is it. Swim over here and look straight at me, will you? Great. Great. Signal's clear. Just need your help with a few basic checks. Need to calibrate our gear. First up, motion sensors and scrolling. Circle around me, swim. Mm. I'm such a butt Great. girl, I motion swear. Motion calibrated. <laughs> now swim hither. Next up, sound check. I'm gonna hum a song. You give me the title. Read me. That's... <laughs> I know that. Eddie Sorrentino, only you. Never did go in for sentimental stuff. Got stuck in my head lately, though, that one. All right, that ought to do it. We are now... Synced. Why now? Prepare to have your mind blown. Wait for it. What the fuck is happening? What in the... Now grab this and hold on tight. What in the Nicholas Sparks is this? Down we go. <laughs> This is... I mean... <laughs> so... This is so intimate. <laughs> I know, it's weird. I kind of find it intimate. Thank God he didn't screw up this... Um... Impressive, huh? <laughs> That's incredible. What is it? Our very own Atlantis. Used to be called Laguna Bend. Just 15 years ago, people still lived here. Wow. Got some connection to this place, right? You got it. Grew up here. <gasps> Haven't been back since Laguna Bend was wiped off the map. What? Why are you showing me this? It's important to me. Got a feeling this will be perfect for my experiment. For what exactly? Why is this stand to be perfect? Hoping you'll be able to pick up all the unfiltered mess of emotions this place brings out in me. Like it or not, you'll react to those feelings. That's what I want to capture. Okay. Sounds Nova. Let's do this. Nova. I'm gonna keep using that now. Sounds Nova. Played this moment coming back so many I'm times thinking of the potato head. chip though with that <laughs> years. Working up the nerve for this. Why didn't you come earlier? Good question. Easy answer would be that I didn't have time. Gear, stars weren't ever aligned. Truth is, the very idea it just felt weird. Besides, didn't want to come here alone. Always some rando. <gasps> We're not a rando. That's a good sign, right? Search Flo's Diner, something. best eatery in town. Only one at that, too. Burgers weren't amazing, too greasy. Big. Of course, I say that now. Back then, they were the best thing I'd ever chewed and swallowed. 
Like this fell off your one and only eatery. Let's see now, your childhood tasted like scop dogs from Capitan Caliente with habanero sauce extra hot. Of course, tasted even better when you stole them off the stand. <laughs> you know what they say, it ain't caliente if it don't burn on the way in and out. <laughs> Got something here. Looks like an old photo cam. DPI 350. Practically an antique. Like it? You kidding? It's awesome. Ooh. Hockey stick. Is there a skating rink here? I wish. Played street hockey on rollerblades. <laughs> Which moves it out? Anyway, anyway, anyway. Sorry, you gotta go. They're calling. They're calling. <laughs> she rejected someone. Weird place for a framed picture. Water probably carried it out of someone's house. Anything to make out? No, not much. Let's talk to her now. Take this camera. Better off in your hands than sitting here collecting algae. Gosh, thanks. <laughs> Shit. What about your parents? Dad was never in the picture. Mom died when I was tiny. Can barely remember her. I still have her picture, but, you know, I see a stranger there. Judy, Judy, watch out for her cooties. Who's that? Those voices. Voices? Didn't you don't buy parents, I'm sorry. What was it like living with your grandparents? How were they? Granddad had a real knack for things technical, taught me everything I know. And the stories he told, uh, never got bored listening to him. Mm. And Grandma was temperamental. Hot one second, cool as steel the next. <laughs> That's rough. Where'd your grandparents go? Night City? Yeah, for a couple years. Rented the unit that's mine now. But they hated the city. Moved up to Oregon. And still go and visit them sometimes. Let's keep going, Judy. Aye, aye, Captain. Follow me. Bitch, she left the camera! <laughs> what the fuck? Well, she said thank you, and she probably looking for appreciated anything the in thought. particular here? Nah, can't hurt to look around, though. Picking up very chill vibes. Feels like we're outside of time, like in a snow globe. After that, we can see what lies up ahead. Imagine anything that could be more out of place in an underwater world. Mmm. <laughs> Bottled water? <laughs> touche, Judy, touche. Oh, we need to get more stuff before we go to I gotta say, don't really get why they left their wheels behind when they had to evacuate. Hey, how old do you think I am? These hunks of metal have got half a century on them. When I was about yay high, they were already here. And not in much better shape. It's good cover for playing Max Tack and Psychos, though. This isn't yours? Poor thing. Been here all alone 
for 20 years. So it is yours? No. It was Jenny Chapman's. Aww. You took her doll? As if. Hit it. That was a monster. You hit it? W why? Because I thought only losers played with dolls. What I really wanted was for her to notice me. Ah, the days when dolls were just kids' toys and nothing else. Want to see what's further on? Come on, then. Want to show you something. Got no idea how weird it feels swimming through here. Where you used to run as a kid. Where daily life grinded along. Can imagine it a bit. going to this church. Never actually went to church. Never even really paid attention to it. It was just there, you know? Once we knew Laguna Bend was to be flooded, people gathered here to plan a protest. Did it achieve anything? Out. How did she pull me out? How did she manage to lift me out? Dunno, didn't think about it. Just did what I had to do. Hey, careful. Easy now. So, you're saying you saved my life. Thank you. Told you diving into this toxic waste was gonna end badly. But you just don't fucking listen. Hey. Heard something weird just now. Sounded like complaining. Complaining? That's the best <laughs> you got, kid? You heard that? Incredible. I, it never happened before, but no worries. It's, it's Johnny Silverhand's construct. I heard his thoughts, not mine. Johnny? What? Oh my god, we just told her. Remember the relic? Reason for the whole damn heist. Johnny Silverhand's digitized psyche was on it, and, well, his personality's seeping into my mind, taking over. You could say his mind's overriding mine. Oh, shit. 
shit, V. That mean you're disappearing? Can you stop it? And here we go. Oh no. Got an idea. A plan. Just don't know if it'll well work. Why do I even bother? Doubt you should go back to the city just now. I'm pretty beat too. Last thing I want to do is drive. Yeah, Johnny's so Let's unfair. How come when he thinks think? with his dick, he's allowed, but when I think with my yes, I'm not. Why the hell not? This is my protest. Whose cottage is that then? You said you knew the owner. One of our neighbors was hell bent on staying in Laguna Bend. Padges literally dragged him out of his house before the water came in. So he built himself another house as close as he possibly could, but then he got sick. Water was way more toxic back then. Yikes. Wow. I feel like this is like her basically vacation home. You must be chilled to the bone. I'll brew a pot. Aww. How do you take yours? Mm. Milk and sugar, please. Going all in, huh? Ah, forgot to start the generator. Mm. I could turn it on. You're gonna take it easy. Promise to take it slow. Is that Evelyn, is that? I think you could have fine-tuned the emotive wave transmitters better back there. I've got some serious surges from you a few times. Power's up. You go that way, you go that you go So be careful. So be careful. Shit. Oh, Evelyn. That must be rough. What was that? Couldn't hear you clearly. Something the matter? No, nothing. She's thinking. Don't bullshit me, Judy. We're still synced, remember? Oh. Clouds has gone to shit. Tiger Claw no next took revenge for Hiromi and the rest. There was a firefight. Tom's dead. Roxanne barely got out alive. House is closed until oh. further notice. Look at her eyes. Look at her eyes. I'd rather not talk or think about it. I didn't want to tell you. Wanted this to be just our day. I want it. It is ours. She's so hot, dude! They really made sure this scene was perfect. I can tell because of all the other glitches in the game. God, her eyeliner is so yes. How? Oh my gosh, she has a, she has a. Ta oh my goodness, she has a tattoo on there too. That's. Oh my god. <laughs> Is she my girlfriend now?
Uh, she's so much hotter than Lady Dimitrescu. Oh, wait, I think I got that name wrong. <sighs> she's so pretty. What the heck? Why do I move this? I move so butch. <laughs> Will you sit with me a while? Here's your coffee. Finally. Morning. I'm so, so happy for them. For us. Yesterday. What was that exactly? Don't remember or you want me to remind you? You know exactly what I'm trying to say. What did it mean? Like to you? I think it, I mean, I hope it was the beginning. Oh my god, please don't shoot next. me down. I can't take Unless it. you see things differently. Ugh. It can be such a gonk sometimes. I ruined my plans, you know that? I was gonna leave Night City in the dust for good. Even started packing. But now, I think, I think I gotta stay. Okay. Why'd you want to leave? Okay. You know, everything that happened. <laughs> Guess it just got to me. But now, from where I stand, Night City started to feel like the place to be. Give me your hand, B. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm not gonna cry. But <laughs> I'm so happy. That's fucking hot. What just happened? She eat. She has so All many cliche tattoos. Just gave you unlimited access to my pad. Whoa. Uh, asking me to move in? If it's what you want. Or just drop by when the urge grabs you. Don't know what to say. Nobody's ever done anything like this for me. Really shows trust. Wanna go there now? You can if you want. Gonna stick around for a bit before I head back. What? <laughs> Is that it? Uh, Is that it? Are we girlfriends now? <laughs> yeah, my first girlfriend. <laughs> I like her a lot. <laughs> so I guess that's it, you guys. Um, I'm gonna be ending the video right there. As always, if you guys like it, do give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.